You got to tune to Warpop on KEXP 90.3 FM live on the web at kexp.org. And it is my pleasure to introduce to you, first time at KEXP, Ziggy Marley. Everybody's worried about time But I just keep that shit off my mind People living on 24-hour clocks But we're on a ride that never stops Hey, Mr. B, the world change But you remain the same And I wonder how you survive Within my bed going down the drain Hey, Miss Dragonfly, I see you look at me It's your beautiful eyes You must be wondering What type of creature am I? A dog looked at me and said Ziggy, why can't we trust man? Send me get together so Why can't you all understand And all trees stood there silently Listening to the words we said As a tear fell he cried What type of creature is man I said Hey Mr. Tree the world changed And I wonder how you survive With the environment going down the drain Hey Miss Butterfly, I see you look at me with your beautiful eyes With my said, you must be wondering What type of creature am I? Everybody worrying about time But I just keep that shit off my mind Living on 24 hour clocks, but we're on a ride. We're on a ride. We're on a ride. We're on a ride that never stops. Hey, Mr. B, the world changed, but you remain the same. And I hope that you survive. We can find going down the drain. Hey, Miss Dragonfly, to see you look at me with your beautiful eyes. Oh my God, you must be wondering what type of creature am I? Yeah. When I said you must be wondering what type of creature is mine. Marley, live in the studios of KEXP on Wopop. Thank you very much. Thank you. It is lovely to have you here. Yes. Um, I've been uh, reading up. I've been a fan since the first record. Mm. Um, and I've been reading up, and I was just thinking about th- what's going on in the world right now and how absolutely wonderful it is to have um, you playing this music, singing about these songs. 
um, just at the time when your father was also uh, dealing with struggles and stripes and reflecting those through song throughout the world. It's a big burden to uh, and a responsibility to to carry that on. And I love how you've been doing that through music, but also through your philanthropic work and work with children. Could you talk about that a little bit? Yeah, well, it's just who you who is who we are as a as persons. As a, even if I wasn't in music, I'd be doing something you know positive in the world. Mm-hmm. So it's just who we are. It's not like a it's not a burden or even a responsibility. It's just who we are. This is just who I am, and I'm just being that. You know. I understand, but I find like especially now with pop music, there is a. Um, I, there's a need to, a lot of artists are like, I don't want to think about that. I want to get bling. I'm like, you know, what's going on in the world? It's not really happening. And <laughs> artists such as yourself, like, no, I want to talk about this. And I want to talk about it in a personal way instead of yeah. uh, just preaching. Yeah, man, I mean, as I say, that's just how we are, you know? Okay, beautiful. <laughs> Is, are you living in Miami right now? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I live in California. All right on. Okay. Yeah. So you're close. You're on the same time. Yes. That's beautiful. Yes. The new record is Fly Rasta, yes. and, you're, and you're touring right now. Yeah. Where will you be heading from here? From here, we're heading, um, I think we're heading over to Boulder, Colorado. Mm-hmm. Um, we already did Europe this year. And we, you know, in the States, we're doing some of Canada too. And then we have, some, we have a date in Singapore, and we'll come back into some more North American. That's a lot of zipping. Yeah, it is. Back I love the zipping. Do you like it, or is it just it's part of the work? No, I like it. I mean, I get to see it, you know. Mm-hmm. Especially on this tour. I, I did some dates some, in some places um, that I've never been before, and it was kind of like in the countryside of America, so I got to see, like, the real America that uh-huh. is outside of the, like, like, the big cities, Yeah, which was cool. I like it. I like the countryside and the trees and the farms, and that's my type of vibe, you know, so I really got to see a lot of America that I really never experienced before, and that was cool for me. Like, oh, this is a real America. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks for. Um, we'll love to hear some music, please. Yeah. Ziggy Marley. Whoop up. I don't condemn. I don't convert. Calling, have you heard? Bring all the lovers to the fold. No one is gonna lose their soul. Now, all my days I've been searching to find out what this life is worth. I've looked, oh yeah, through time I've searched, yes, it's love, love is my religion, love is my religion, Oh 
I'm done searching now Found out what this life is worth Not in a book is it found Oh my friends It's all around Ziggy Marley, live in the studios of KEXP on Wopop. Can you take me through your... You've been releasing records uh, for a long time now. Can you take me through the process of, like, when do you know it's time to release a record? When are one of the songs written? Well, I think the first thing comes is not even releasing a record. It's the writing of the songs, you know? So we don't think about record until we have the songs them. And then the songs them come... In there, in what we call due season, when they come, they come. Okay. You know, so I have to, I have to wait. I'm like a farmer. I have to wait <laughs> on the crop to bear fruit. I, I'm not, I cannot like genetically modify it to rush. I'm a person. I wait, have patience, and I wait till the season come. Okay. The writing seasons, I call it. Now, even when I'm off season, there's still things collecting in my head. And then when the season come now. There's already some seeds planted back here. Got it. That I kind of you know, get to and, you know, you know, fertilize and figure it out, you know. So that's, I think that's where it starts from. That's how I do it. Um, and I, it's something that I kind of found out that I have, I have my seasons for writing. Uh-huh. It's not like, I'm not writing every day. There's a certain time when it's just that time, you know, and then it happens. And that's, that's when we start thinking about record. Once we start writing songs and we have um, and we have songs, we start thinking, well, all right, when can I put these songs on a record? When can we put out the record? And then that becomes a whole timetable according to the industry. Okay. When, when it's best to put out a record and all these type of things. You know, but the music come organically, naturally that way. Are there any particular studios you like to record in or is it just when it's time to, to plant, it's time to go? Well, yeah, I have a little studio in my house that I, that I kind of... You know, there's a little laboratory that I mess around and do a lot of things in. And there's sometimes a lot of music that don't make it on a record that's just too experimental. Oh, nice. You know? <laughs> Love to hear that. We'd like just too, to, you know, too crazy. We like Can't that kind of stuff here on KXP. We really do. <laughs> Anything like that would be awesome. Uh, could you introduce the band, please? Yeah, man. The band, we have Tekeshi from left to right, Santa Davis, Rock D, Drake, Chantel Hernandez, Tracy Azad. Thank you for being here. Yeah. Uh, some more music, please, if you yeah. could.
Marley, live on KXP. When did you know that you were going to be singing? Was it just, I am the son of Bob Marley and this is what I have to do? Or was it, did no. you rebel? Or did you like... No, I wasn't, I'm not a really good singer, you know. So I, I don't really, I sing, I sing, but I'm not really like a you know, good singer, singer. I decided to sing because I decided, say, well, we'll get inspiration for right songs. And the real important thing is not even the singing, it's the song. That is the important thing, mm-hmm. is the message. Even more important than my singing. So that is, that is how I get to be singing, because we get to write these words. And we find a purpose in life from the inspiration that, that, that comes from getting the ideas to write these words. Then all oh, here is a purpose. These words have some meaning to them. So then we start seeing the words them, mm-hmm. and you know, there yeah, that's how it come. But um, I have two small daughters, five and eight, yeah. and uh, a couple of years ago I turned them on to your father's work, and it's music that I really enjoy having them listen to and yeah. having them, and to come from from that like that song is going to be played for hundreds of years, mm-hmm. and to know that you're that close to it, did you feel that it was 
I have to carry on this legacy because I was intrigued. Oh. After your father, reggae got hard, and yeah. dance hall, and and there's this this softness and this this uh, beauty to the music that doesn't need a oh, lot of band. Yeah, yeah, you're saying that's true. That's true. No, I mean the music have different things. Then it have the, the spiritual side, which is this side, and then it have that more physical, material side, mm-hmm. which is that side. You know. Um, but we, you know, we coming from the spiritual side. Um, but no, we never feel any, any um, kind of thing where we have to continue this. The only reason why we're doing it is because we get inspiration to do it. Okay. I could not be doing it if it was just, oh, my father, let me continue this. Got it. And where, what, where would my, where, what would I, where would my things be coming from? Would I be, you know? So the only reason why we're doing it is through the grace of the Almighty. We have been inspired to do these things, just like my father was. And just like many before him and many after us, there will be those who are inspired. Mm-hmm. There, there will be those who are not doing it because of somebody else did it, but because they have been inspired to do it. And I am one of those. Perfect. Thank you. There's some more, please, if you can. I don't want to live on Mars. I don't want to drive space cars. I just want to be with you and do the things we do. Wanna escape to the moon Even if the world went boom I just wanna be with you And do the right things to you You give me everything I need You're my God and you're my breeze Let me get down and thank you please Hey let me lay here for a while Cause your beauty makes me high If you cry then I will cry yeah. Hey, let me make one thing clear Nothing can compare Your love is the blue sky Your love is a butterfly I don't want to live on Mars I don't want to drive space cars I just want to be with you And do the things we do Don't want to escape to the moon Even if the world went boom I just wanna be with you and do the right things to you. Oh, good karma, you're my queen. Precious things my eyes have seen. Sweetest place has ever been. You make me feel just like a king. I'll never leave for that girl. Oh, my darling, you're my world. That witch called winter can be mean. Summers that I've never seen They say I'm love crazy Love crazy Yeah I don't wanna live on Mars And I don't wanna drive space cars I just wanna be with you And do the things we do Don't wanna escape to the moon Even if the world went boom I just wanna be with you And do the right thing You can't swim, don't tap the water Believe what you want But this is my right of view I want to be cool So let me get through to you To you I don't want to live on Mars I don't want to drive space cars I just want to be with you Siggy Marley in the studios on Wopop on KEXP. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having us. Thank you for the time. Please come back again. Sure. I want to thank Jenna, Jim, Justin, 
Renata, Kevin, and Matt, and everybody else here at KXP for making this happen. This is Wolf Op, KXP 90.3, Seattle, where the music matters. Discover new music at listener-powered KEXP.org. Painless? Pretty much. Okay. Pretty much. Good, good, good. <laughs>